Hello, I'm Lumber Squatch, and this is me on a shirt, and the show is Package Rebellion. Hello, everybody, welcome back to Package Rebellion. I am your host, Lumber Squatch. Uh, I wanted to thank everybody who, uh, I don't want to say tuned in, but watched on YouTube uh, the unboxing. Or Venom Prisons, Venom Prison, not Prism, but Venom Prison's newest album, Samsara. Uh, I did that last week. I was still a little sick, and I definitely showed in the video. So I appreciate everybody who stuck around and watched the whole thing. Uh, no Instagram Live last week, and no Instagram Live this week because I was going to record last night, which I usually do on a Monday night. Battery died in my camera. I don't think of these things apparently that I should, hey, you know, probably charge it every couple of weeks or so, but nonetheless, I'm here. I'm recording Tuesday. Let's get to it. This is the newest one. It's an EP from uh, New York Black Metal, Black Metalers, Black Metal Band, Black Anvil. And this is the EP Miles out on STB Records. Uh, it is a four song EP. And it is dedicated to the loss, well, I don't know if it's dedicated to the loss of the founding member of the Devil's Blood, but he was a founding member of the Devil's Blood and Black Anvil's friend, uh, Selim, I'm, I'm looking at the word, the name, I'm trying to pronounce this correctly, Selim Lamucci. And one thing I realized, I was like, oh, okay, it's kind of weird to call it Miles. Selim, spelled backwards, is Miles. I figured these things out on my own. It is a four song EP, again out now on STB Records. Uh, Featured two new songs and two covers. The covers, uh, interesting choice for one of them, which was Merciful Fate, A Corpse Without a Soul. Uh, I'm not the biggest Merciful Fate fan, but nonetheless, oh, couldn't find my knife. They did a really good job with that. Um, they also covered a song, which obviously makes sense, from the Devil's Blood, it's called Everlasting Saturnalia. It's totally, totally different than what Black Anvil has done. Um, nonetheless, let's get this thing open and see what we have inside, shan't we? Um, I will say, I like, I know, I love Black Anvil. Uh, their album as was was as was was uh just an awesome album when it came out 2016 2017 around there and again it, it kind of bucks the traditional black metal sound and you know the purest all shit on it. it's not black metal it's like the people who call anything that isn't the meteor psychobilly psychobilly it's come on let's stop with this nonsense um so, when I, of course I saw they were going to put it on EP, I'm like, yeah, I'm going to get that. But then when I saw what STV Records was doing with the artwork and everything that goes along with it, maze balls. Um, there are three editions that were printed, or pressed, or however you want to put it. The Die Hard edition of 200, the not-so-standard edition of 300, and there was a test press, 25 hand-numbered only. Now, I don't remember which version came with this. I want to say... It was the Die Hard Edition, which I think is the red vinyl. This is an awesome pin. I mean, it's heavy. Right there. It's uh, New York Black Metal Sigil. Sigil? Sigil? So right there, if you can see, it says it's kind of like New York Hardcore. It's New New York Black Metal. Really well done. Take a look at that. Oh, that's kind of blurry. You can't really see that. I'll take a picture. I'll put it in the video. And on the back it has STB Records. I mean, this is really nice. And of course, sticker. And another sticker. Love stickers. Let's put this aside for now. That is awesome. Really dig that. Uh, in memory of Salam Lamucci. E. Lamucci. New York Black Metal. Coming soon. March 2019, which is here. It was released digitally on March 4th, which um, I believe was the anniversary of Selim's passing. 
so they did that and then this was released when did this come out the 25th okay so black anvil miles this is beautiful i mean the artwork is just awesome new york black metal uh track listing iron sharpens iron miles everlasting saturnalia and a corpse without a soul I don't know which one this is because they're both the same. The only difference is inside. I'm trying to. Oh, looking. How much time I got left? That's a problem. I gotta get a new camera because this DSLR, it only records video up to 12 minutes. And obviously, I like to talk. And I hear my kid yelling upstairs because he's playing Fortnite yelling at people. So it's die cut, which is really awesome. Here's the inner sleeve. The back has lyrics to the two new songs, which is awesome. Okay, so this one is the not so standard edition. Super clear, but it, you might not be able to pick it up on this. The etching on the back, side A or side one, however you want to call it, is the only one that has the four tracks but the back has a, a beautiful etching. So that would be the not so standard edition because I know the Die Hard edition is the red one. And then we'll get to the test pressing. Let's get that out of the way. Let's open up the, oh. look at me looking, I'm trying to be all perfect. Where the hell is it? There it is, whoo. Time to get the eyesight checked, old man. So we'll open this one up, and this one is going to be the Die Hard Edition, which should be the red vinyl. Oh, look at that. Again, die cut, same thing. Carries over. The two editions, the covers and everything are the same. But when you open it up, oh yeah. There it is in red. You can't really see the etching on this one though. It's there, but it's really light. Oh, yeah. Don't worry, I will take pictures and put them in. I, it's, I love it when they record companies and, and bands put the time in and, and put packaging together like this. It just makes it that much more awesome because, and this is gonna sound totally however you want it to be, but you go, uh, music is art and art is music. And they, they both collide at the same time. So here you go. Ah, there goes a the box. That's okay. There was a box within a box. Pile of boxes. You watched the last show, I put a picture of the pile of boxes in there. So A to Z Media, Artist Black Anvil. This is test pressing sleeve. And here is the actual test pressing, right? So it comes in this awesome sleeve. Um, I don't remember what they call those. There's like a fancy word for them or something that I should look up. But it's sealed. I'm not going to ever open this. And this is number 18 of 25 test pressings. Let me tell you, this, this, there was a lot of confusion with this. and uh, Because originally it said March 4th was going on sale. And it did, the, the digital. But everybody thought the physical was going on sale. So when... People were going to band camp. It was like, it said sold out, sold out, sold out. And it was like, oh crap, how did we all miss it? I mean, I literally set my alarm to be there at 12 o'clock to get this. But it turns out they were just placeholders. They weren't actually sold out. They went on sale uh, March 9th at 12 a.m. Eastern time. And I was there, boom, 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 got them all. Oh, happy, happy camper I was. Happier than Michael Jackson at Cub Scout camp. So anyway, there you have it, the three editions. Uh, I'll take some separate pictures, I'll insert them into the video. But I gotta applaud Black Anvil and STB Records for putting this package together. It's beautiful, uh, the music is great, the packaging is phenomenal, it's such a great idea. What a way to honor the memory of a friend, honestly. Somebody who was in the music business, who loved music, uh, just as much as these guys do, so uh, kudos to them. 
I look forward to the, what they have in the future, both from Black Anvil, obviously, and STB Records. As for me, I'm Lumber Squatch. I'm out for now. I'll be back next week. Not sure what I have, but I'm back. I'm, I'm like herpes. I don't go away. I'm always here, and I'm really fucking annoying sometimes. Uh, so hit me up, package rebellion 333 at gmail.com and on the Instagrams at package underscore rebellion. Everything's in the show notes on the YouTube videos. Thanks for watching. Thank you for stopping by. Click like below, click share. It's very appreciated. Uh, just trying to get this up off the ground. Little by little, we're getting there. Thank you. I keep looking down because I got to click that exit button down there. But I can't see my mouse. Don't pay any attention to me. Well, pay attention to the first half of the, you know, most of the show, and that's not this part.